Hello there. In this tutorial, I'm going to discuss about consolidate option. The consolidate option is uh, a great feature uh, which we from from which we can add databases. Now, for example, if we have a consolidate option, uh, like we have one database of, for example, Ram's salary there. So we exactly wants to add this. For example, we have give the contract to Ram uh, for six months only, and we wanted uh, Ram to work for six months and not afterwards. But later on, we realized that he worked uh, quite well, so we extended his salary and we extended his contract as well. So what exactly happened that we have given him a work? from July to December as well. So now this is one database. We thought that RAM will work for six months, first six months, and that's it. But afterwards as well, when we extend his contract, we will require another sheet to create his salary statement. So that is the salary statement. Now finally, what is the outcome of the salary? That was the thing to be uh, that that we need to think for the same. So that's what we we are requires what we are doing. So as of now, we're going to count this that what is going to be happen and what what would the outcome of the RAM salary uh, like the we a grand total. So what would the grand total? For example, we want a grand total and. Uh, uh, he wants to know about the salary of RAM. Uh, so, what is the final statement? What was the salary of RAM? So, let me go through it. First, I will press equal. And then we go to sheet 1. We have to go to the total. Then we have to add the plus. That as second sheet, we have to plus the another grand total and hit enter. The total salary is 1,20,600 rupees. We have paid to RAM. That is the final salary of RAM. Now, what would be the outcome of RAM's total salary? And if you want the entire chart, like you can see that. The chart is in salary one, chart is one sheet, salary two is in another sheet. So it looks like a, a divided data. And we want uh, equal data. We want both data to be on same page. We can very much achieve that. So I'm copying here, pasting here once again so that uh, it looks great to find out the database and uh, we want I exactly uh, a database called the entire salary statement okay so what is the salary statement that now we will get the consolidate option from here at data tab consolidate and we exactly uh, needs to add the database so for example if i wants to add the database at consolidate and you will get the option call a uh, couple of functions like sum count average and all that so basically we want a sum only at sheet 1 I want to go to sheet 1 so that uh, a browse option I want to go to sheet 1 I want to uh, add these databases I want to add these databases then I will say that uh, add. Then at sheet two, I want you to go to sheet two, and since uh, all are selected already, because in sheet two as well, we have selected the same uh, columns and rows. That's why it automatically selected. So we will need to add uh, that as well. So at sheet three, what would be the outcome? Now total. Now, for example, since we have uh, opted the top label as well, the top uh, row as well. So we're going to select the top row as well. That is the month. 
and we need to create two links as a search data you want to left column as well like any other database you can add that otherwise you just left that uh, we want to create links to search data okay if there is a problem okay so there is the database now you can see the database is now finally added so this is what exactly it's going to be and uh, and you can see it if you want to explore that you find that uh, what is the first six months outcome what is the salary uh, the total amount we have paid that is 55,600 rupees and then in le next six months what we have paid to RAM that's 65,000 rupees so total outcome we have paid to RAM is uh, 1 lakh 20,600 rupees now this is what uh, exactly the total amount uh, for RAM now for example if I want to create another data like I want to 